guys, welcome to the Stealthy Crafter. I'm Jessica and today we have an unboxing for you guys. Um, today's unboxing is Mercury from Diamond Art Club by Roy Trin. It is a square diamond painting and it is 20 by 30 inches or 50.8 by 76 centimeters. So let's get into this. I already took the plastic off to make it a little bit easier, plus so there's not so much noise um, going on into it. But um, how are you guys doing today? Hope you guys are doing well. We got our toolkit. Let's pull everything else out here. We got our canvas, and there we go. All right. So first off, we have our logbook sticker. Um, if you don't know what a logbook sticker is, it is well essentially it's a sticker that's meant for your logbook, and your logbook is a thing that you could keep track of your diamond paintings that you have, um, like what what day you started, what day you ended, um, how many colors, what were your thoughts. Um, I personally put this mostly on my box right here so that way I can keep track of it, uh, of what I have in stock so it's easier for me. So I'll do that just now. Um, then we have our toolkit right here. Um, so if we look in here, if I can open it up. <laughs> there we go. I'll pull everything out and we can go through each and every thing. There we go. All right. So first off, we have our diamond painting pen. Oops. <laughs> and I dropped it. But we also have a matching squishy to go with it. Then we have our tweezers. Since it is, is a square diamond painting, we have tweezers which are branded. We also have some baggies as you can see here. Um, along with our pen, we have a seven and four thin multi-placer. And then we have our wax right here, our two heart-shaped wax in a container. Very nice. Um, and then we have a boat or tray, whichever one you would prefer to call it. It's uh, just a plain white one with a stopper. Um, and then our extra little goodies here, we have a some washi tape and a cover minder. So if you guys don't know what these are meant for, I'll show you guys in just a little bit of what you can use, how you can use them. So I'll just put all of this back in its bag and we will get into the next part. Now we have our canvas here. All right, this is what I'm more excited about. <laughs> so as you can see, you can see that it has a dust cover, which helps protect it from dust and you know, all the elements and stuff, hopefully, for the most part, sometimes, you know, water damage and things. And we'll just get the drills out. We'll get all of this out, all right. As you can see, we have our drills right here. I'll show them more in detail just a little bit later. We have our thank you for your purchase booklet. We got some tips and tricks. We got step-by-step -step, um, instructions. We got uh, a QR code for the video for that, as well as going to their Facebook group. Um, and then we have our inventory sheet, which has a bigger sticker if you wanna use that as your logbook sticker instead. But as you can see, we have 58 colors, two ABs, and then we have something called um, fairy drills, if I remember correctly. So we have two ABs and two fairy drills. If you look, you can see that these are pre-cut stickers, so you can peel them off and put them on your containers easily, or your baggies. But yeah, as you can see, we have this beautiful canvas that we're gonna about to open just a moment, so which I will now. <laughs> so I'll just roll this a bit so that way it will lay a little bit flatter. Um, this is a poured glue canvas, so it will it will be okay to, to do this. Um, it's not gonna hurt the canvas at all, um, at all. So there we go. And we'll just do that. Oh, she's so pretty. So one of the things, um, 
well, first off, if we look here, we have the um, legend on both sides, and we also have the scallop edges, which helps prevent fraying. We have the do what makes you sparkle all the way up here at the top. And then if we look down here at the bottom, we have the um, thumbnail with the licensing details. We have their socials. And then we also have the lifetime warranty. So as I was about to say, one of the things I wanted with this uh, was um, it's part of Sailor Moon, like uh, from his, he has like a fan art series. So he has Sailor Mart. Um, uh, a fan art and this is Sailor Mercury um, and they're like in the style of goddesses or Greek goddesses I'm, I'm assuming I'm not a hundred percent certain but um this has been like up in the for voting for uh, what what canvases you want and I've been voting for like all of them <laughs> because I love Sailor Moon along with my um, daughter so I've been like really ecstatic to get see if this would come out and now that it is I'm hoping that the rest will come out so cross your fingers but as you can see, isn't she beautiful? I'm so excited about her. She has a book in her hand. There's a beautiful scenery all around her. And I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm in love with her. I love her headscarf right now. And her dress is so flowy. Oh my goodness. And then like you have the pillar back here. And I, like I said, all these beautiful flowers down here. But um, let's get into the drills. Hopefully this won't be too loud. So as you can see, these are the drills and it has her name right here, the canvas's name on here. So that way, if you have your canvas in your, um, in your uh, drill separated, you can always find it. Oh, and I did mention that I was going to tell you um, the reason for the, um, for the uh, cover minders and the washi tape. So I'll do that really quickly before I get started with the drills. So with washi tape, um, one of the things you can do is to, there is always a little bit of excess glue around the edges and to help prevent um, like dirt and stuff sticking to it, you could put washi tape around the edges to help prevent that. It is also good for, um, to mark out your canvas as a grid so that way you can uh, cut your canvases into squares like uh, on the plastic sheet here, not the actual canvas. So you just put it on top of the, <clears throat> excuse me, top on the plastic and then you just mark your squares and that way you can, you can uh, do it in smaller sections instead of going all over the place and feeling a little overwhelmed. Um, so one of the things you can do with a cover minder, and I'll pull this a little bit right here so you can see, is that it holds the plastic back. So what you do is just pull the plastics like so. And this has two magnets, one right here, um, and then one attached to the back of the cover minder itself. And you just hold the canvas like so, so that way you can uh, work work on it without the plastic falling on top of it. So, there we go. All right, now let's get into our, our drills. <laughs> I can't wait to see what the fairy, um, fairy diamond drills look like because um, a lot of people have been talking about how sparkly and pretty they are, so I want to see what they look like. So, so let's see. All right, let's go with this. First off, we have 798, 930, 402, 3782. Then we have 3765, 3842, 3760, two bags of 310. And look how sparkly the look, it's just like they're not even ABs and they're just super sparkly. Um, so then we have two bags of 938, 842, 803, uh, 839, 334, 3857. 814, uh, two bags of 948, 400, 3771, 336, and 951. That goes here. Next up we have is a bag of 951, two bags of 754, and then it looks like we have our first AB, which is 141. 
Um, if you don't know what AB stands for, it stands for Aurora Borealis. And um, what that means is it has an iridescent type coating on it to make it sparkle compared to the rest of the drills. As you can see that the drills are plenty sparkly as it is, but look how much more so that this one is. So next up we have is 931, 169, 524, 918, uh, 3787, 794, lots of blues and greens, of course. We got 890, 611, 758, 841, uh, 3856, 3776, 3325, 3861, and 926. Next is 160, 159, 3838, 920, and it looks like we have our first fairy drill, so which is C3747. And from what I was told that they have like a glittery type on top of the drills. Let's see if we can show you what they look like. It looks really like a subtle uh, look to the ABs itself. And then we also have our second fairy drills, which is C720. And it looks, yeah, like they have like a, like it's just a sm bit more of a subtle look to the ABs instead of, of how sparkly they are, but they are still going to be really pretty. Then we have 407, um, 935, 301, uh, 452, 895, 161, 7, uh, 96, 37, 56, 9, 37, and then we have our second AB, which is 129, and then 743, uh, 350, 4, uh, no, 347, and then 352. I will clean just a bit and look over what uh, where the ABs in those fairy drills are and I'll show you in just a moment all right guys so um, if we look here we have one in uh, a dot for our ABs and then we have G and K for our fairy drills um, if we look here around her um, shawl uh, slash dress area we have the G's which are located right here and also around the areas down here as well. Um, they're more around her head scarf right around here. Um, for the second one we have are located all in her flowers. So we have the second fairy ones right here in the flowers. Uh, right here and also here. Um, we have some in her dress and then it looks like the little tiny flower that's up here has um, some of those drills as well. Um, then we have for the ABs, those white ABs, they're all around her, kind of help to give her this glow effect. Like the, like I said, I think like it's since you're like Greek goddesses and stuff like that, so it kind of just gives her this ethereal look. Um, and then we have ones all located right here and here. So. It's a good, good, uh, good selection of drills all throughout. There is a lot of color blocking I can see here. Not too much confetti as I was looking through it, which is very helpful. Um, I think that it's going to look really cool. I think I would like to have some ABs located in the book that she's holding. I might just substitute some of them right there. Um, but let me know what you think, uh, guys think down below. Um, uh, please give, please put a comment and like, and subscribe if you like this video. Um, otherwise I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.